Intense negotiations over a UN resolution calling for a truce in Gaza are ongoing. At first, a vote on this resolution was expected on Monday. Then it was moved to Tuesday morning, Tuesday afternoon, and now it's been pushed until Wednesday. All of this in order to avoid a US veto. This resolution calls for an urgent suspension of hostilities, but it also calls for urgent steps towards a sustainable cessation of hostilities. And it's that wording that the United States has taken issue with, according to diplomatic sources here. Well, the US has repeatedly made it clear that it does not want a ceasefire because, like Israel, it believes that that would only benefit Hamas. So negotiations over the exact wording of this resolution continue. This resolution calls also for the UN to monitor all of the aid distribution into Gaza. None of the previous resolutions had that element. Essentially, this is a resolution for aid access for civilians in Gaza. If it doesn't pass, then it will be yet another blow to US credibility here here at the United Nations. The situation for civilians in Gaza is really dire, as Tor Venisland, the UN's coordinator for the Middle East peace process, told the Security Council on Tuesday. He said that the delivery of humanitarian aid uh, in the Gaza Strip continues to face nearly insurmountable challenges. He described the humanitarian response system in Gaza as being on the brink.